Good afternoon, my name is Kenneth Bourne. We're with AirTech Incorporated. What we're going to be discussing today is one of the several ways to purge the oil system of the 912 engine. Uh, this is my preferred method because it's very quick and it does not waste any oil at all. Uh, so what we have is about three and a half liters in the oil can. Uh, what we're going to do is replace this cap with a non-vented cap. We're going to plug this line and then we're going to remove the return line. What we're trying to do here is pressurize this can. We're going to use a, a small air compressor and we're going to put about 50 psi in this can. Uh, the first thing we're going to do is break this line loose from the uh, oil pump. We're going to push oil through this line, which is going to push all the air out. As soon as we have a little oil coming out that line, we're going to put it back on. And then we have this other line here, which is attached to a mechanical oil pressure gauge. And we uh, have this line unattached from the gauge after we have oil to the uh, oil pump and then we turn the engine over while pressurizing this and we're looking to push oil into this line. Once we have oil in this line, we know that there is oil flowing through the oil pump. After that's completed, we attach the gauge to the line and then we're going to run the engine to verify that we have good oil pressure. Okay, so this is the second portion of uh, purging the oil system. Uh, now that we've verified that we do have oil to the oil pump and we had oil pressure register on the gauge by just turning the engine over with the uh, starter solenoid being jumped to a push button, uh, we're going to actually run the engine now and verify that we have good steady oil pressure while the engine is running. So here we go. Master on, fuel pump on, choke, set to idle. Parking brake. Clear. <laughs> 